With an upper motor neuron lesion or reflex bladder, the brain has difficulty coordinating the filling and emptying of the bladder because of the spinal injury. Even though the spine is damaged, messages flow below the injury between the spine and the bladder through the automatic nerves getting the bladder ready to fill. The automatic nerves can work without being connected to the brain. The voluntary nerves don't work properly because they are no longer connected to the brain. The bladder is filling and the nerves allow it to fill and stay relaxed. The tap is held tight so nothing leaks out. At this stage the pressure in the bladder is low. The bladder starts to fill full and tries to empty using the automatic nerves, but the brain doesn't get the message. Due to the spinal injury, the brain can't open the tap using the voluntary nerves. The bladder keeps trying to empty using the automatic nerves. This causes high pressure which can push urine back into the kidneys. A catheter is used to open the tap before the pressure gets too high. 